You just a little bit cuckoo for the Cocoa Puffs over that man. But yeah, so the way these kids will have you jumping through hoops. It's not giving dance. I don't know what she was thinking. It's not giving dance. It's giving like, let's go to the mall. make me some breakfast it's literally it's 10 57 breakfast i was gonna go ahead and eat lunch but i'm more so feeling breakfast -y, so i think i'm gonna do some turkey bacon um and i don't know where the freak these gnats are coming from but i'm gonna need I'm gonna need them to not be in my space. Some turkey bacon. This is from Trader Joe's. We're gonna do some bacon. Some cashew yogurt. I love their cashew yogurt. This one is unsweetened. I've never tried this one, but I'm gonna do some granola. And it, I love it because it has coconut cream and it doesn't bother my stomach, so. Sorry, y'all. I love it because it doesn't have dairy um, and it does not bother my stomach, so I really like this. I usually get the strawberry or the blueberry, but this one was a bigger container, so I was trying to get more for my money, you know? So I got plain, I'll add honey, and I'm gonna add some granola. Actually, the granola might be enough because it's um, chocolate. So yeah, that, this is the granola from Target. It tastes like cookies. <laughs> mm -hmm. Ooh, if I had some bananas, y'all, yeah, that would be so good. So let me get a spoon. My grandmother told me to never eat yogurt with a metal spoon. I don't remember exactly what she said happens but we're gonna just do what she says so the only thing about this yogurt that is kind of like it's like very watery let me find the date before may 2nd so oh mm -hmm. let me show you so i'm just gonna do a few Maybe like y'all yeah, know what this tastes like. To be honest with you, and I'm not mad at it. If you've ever tasted plain Greek yogurt, disgusting, like disgusting. But this is. Tastes like sour cream. So if you're wanting to be healthy, you can use this for a sour cream replacement. That is so weird to say and I'm about to eat it as yogurt. It literally feels like I'm eating sour cream. So I may be using this as a sour cream alternative because there's only 150 calories um, in this container. Don't give me the lion child. Um, I'm not, I don't count calories. Um, and I also get it from Target or Walmart. It's the Nate's or Kroger um, Pure Organic Raw Honey. So I don't need that much because the uh, granola is sweet. So I'm gonna do a light drizzle like a little bit and then sprinkle this granola let's see okay you guys so i'm gonna sit here i have my notebook my notepad and my book this book is so good you guys 
And if you have not read it, I'll just give you a little teaser without like doing too much. Baby Verity is crazy. Like I get it. No, actually I don't get it because now baby, mm -mm. you just a little bit cuckoo for the Cocoa Puffs over that man. But I feel like a lot of women be like that. Um, but she was so cuckoo to the point to where she was trying to give herself an abortion. She was trying to give herself an abortion because her fiance was gonna be more in love with her babies than her. Like he, she wanted all of the attention on her. And once she felt like that was getting compromised, she was like, nah, what? That is cuckoo. Now eat my breakfast. I ended up doing some English muffins. They're whole wheat, turkey bacon, and egg whites, and egg yolk, and spinach, and omelet, basically. So I'm gonna eat this, and I have my water, and I'll call you back once I get done. I'm not gonna eat and be rude. Y'all, these kids, I'm gonna say it over and over. I bought this jumpsuit from Amazon like so long ago. And I, it's like baggy right here because it's too big. Hello. They didn't answer the door, so. But yeah, so the way these kids will have you jumping through hoops because not you ordering stuff with what money, okay? <laughs> So she told this little boy, and of course it's she in because it's like super cheap. She told this little boy, if you want me to go to the dance with you, you gonna want to buy my dress. What? Like, sis, I would have bought your dress. Like, I feel you, but I'm, I'm like, as a parent, I'm like, okay, I would have, I could have bought the dress. Now let me see what the dress look like because it's just a black dress. Honestly, I could put this on. Where it is and it's long sleeve like is it hot like what 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 you trying to do okay and it's from she and sexy child because thinking it's not giving dance it's giving like let's go to the mall oh y'all y'all know what i just remembered i went to target while i was out of town why did they leave the little um my forehead looks so humongous right now why did they leave the little like security thing on the shorts so i can't even wear the damn shorts because the little thing is on there and you know you can't take it off i don't know is it like it's like a pin needle thing or i don't know if it's like ink in the inside i don't know but it's on there so i have my receipt so i can take it to my local target and just see like hey i bought these can you please take it off let me show you because baby i'm not Stealing. It literally just was missed. I just, I just want to be able to do my run or my walk or whatever. They're the all in motion shorts, girl. Why? Why is the? What am I doing with this? What am I doing with that? And you know you can't take that off. There's the little machine that is supposed to. Take it off. These shorts were $20 or $22 or something like that. So baby, run me my money or take this off. I like it though because they even have little pockets. So I was like, oh yeah, this is gonna be perfecto. But otherwise you all, it's been a pretty productive, no. I mean, I'm doing too much. It has not been productive, but it's been a good relaxing day. So Y'all, I cannot peel an egg to save my life, but this, don't even pay attention to that. It's perfectly boiled. Dukes. 
I like a lot of egg in mine. Okay, that's the perfect consistency. Let me clean my mess. I can't. Y'all are gonna think I'm weird, possibly, because of how I like to eat mine. Because I like to add a bit of lettuce. So I'm just gonna take like a few romaine hearts. Rinse that off. Cause I don't need eating texture. Like I don't wanna just be eating mush. You know. A tomato. I like to cut up tomato. Okay. Baby, a paper towel don't stand a chance in my kitchen. Okay? I will go through some paper towels and then be mad when I, when I don't have any. But every time I go to the store, I grab a bag for that reason. Okay, so for the tuna salad, I add a little bit of lemon pepper, just a bit. Regular pepper. And then mix it up. To me, this is tuna salad, literally. And I would, I would put this like in a wrap or with crackers. I seen um, somebody was eating their tuna salad and they had put like sugar and stuff in it. Okay, I don't even know if I've ever shown you guys like the kids bathroom. Right now it's very much looking lived in, but this is the kids bathroom. Um, oh my nose. So they did a new shower curtain. This is their bathroom. And yeah, this is just from the old house. So I will be keeping this cause this is brand new. It's like a boho style shower curtain. The clear one and the, what you call this? The rod. So from TJ Maxx today, I picked up just a regular black, black rod. So I was kind of in between like getting a um, regular one like this one or a like curved one. That's kind of what I wanted, but you know, it's just for the kids. So this will be fine. And then I got them some shower hooks. These are what they look like. So super cute. Uh, it's definitely an upgrade from their previous ones. And then I got these Tahari Home um, like mats, I guess. Very, very good quality. I may try to, they only had one, otherwise I would have gotten one for my bathroom as well. Um, but yes, so I got this as well. And yeah, so now I'm gonna try and hang everything up together. See, you gotta really come in here and check on these kids, y'all, cause they will have this looking a mess. So the curtain rod is down. It kind of left marks on the wall, which is, it is what it is at this point. What? What? Yes, I'm gonna cook them. So I'm gonna clean their shower and then I'm gonna clean y'all's shower. Thank you, mom. Thanks. Two, a bird just tried flying in through the other window. I know, I don't know what's up with that. I need a big bag for that. I'm gonna throw that away. All right, so I'm gonna finish. Jesus! <laughs> yeah, so you can definitely tell like the girl side versus my son. My son keeps his side fairly clean. <laughs> um, child, my daughter's into makeup now, so it's makeup on stuff. And you know, white and black, everything, y'all. 
wasn't really thinking that part through but there it's fine i'm here so i can do it so yeah i'm gonna do that and then i'll show you guys what it looks like at the end okay you guys so i am getting ready to it is um hair appointment day i am so excited when i look at my hair i'm like okay i have a lot of hair um but to be honest it needs to be either like you see my ends are just straight you can kind of see like where my curl stops and then it's like straight so regardless if i was gonna get my hair cut or not so i'm gonna get i'm gonna get a cut my husband is gonna be a little bit upset but it's fine like he loves my hair long i'm not attached to my hair i cut my hair once a year and yeah girl like that's just what it is so i'm gonna get dressed and do my makeup um that way i can make this kind of like a content content day and i'll call y'all back when i get done girl i follow this lady on tiktok night freddie jean <laughs> my friend had got me some wine one time and it was so good i just don't know what it was so i'm gonna see if i can find it on our instagram messages i'm gonna show y'all I don't remember the name of it. It's like a red wine. They want salmon tonight, so that's what we're doing. So I'm in Kroger. I don't remember the name of it. It was so good. I have no idea. So I am about to clean up my kitchen, but I wanted to show you this wine real quick. This is the wine. It tastes so good you guys it's Roscato Rosso Dolce and I'm about to be like my grandmother hold on I'll be right back so growing up my grandmother she loved wine right she drank it out of a red solo cup okay with a straw because she was classy but I don't have any wine glasses I actually threw them all away when I moved so I'm gonna have to just do what I gotta do and I'm gonna use this glass. So I'm gonna pour my wine and start cooking. It's good. It's like not too sweet, not too bitter. It's like perfect in between. Stop taking my shoes. Go put your shoes up. No, I'm using it. Mm-hmm. Every second, every minute, man, I swear.